Bobby, well, we, first of all, our match on Tuesday against Balomino was called off by the referee after a late pitch inspection. It looks good and you've been out there training all tonight. What's it like? Yeah, it's good. It was brilliant tonight in training. And, um, there was a couple of wet areas the other day against, Bal- other day against Balomino that I think put it off. But apart from that, the pitch has been brilliant this season and, and we're raring to go. We're, we're dying to get these games played and I can't wait for this run where, where games are going to come thick and fast and, and we have to just be ready for it. Last time out against Lauren, we put four past them in a really convincing display. Does that give the team confidence whenever you're going into a game, knowing that we might not have been on a great run of form recently, but we have played against these guys and you know we can't beat them? Yeah, obviously we've played them a couple of times this season and, and again last year and every time we play them, it's a very, very competitive game. So really looking forward to it. They, they try and play football the right way, the same as us. So hopefully it'll be an exciting game. And, and um, as you say, you know we can take confidence from that game, but we really need to try and get ourselves in a good run of, of form here. And, um, hopefully um, Saturday's no better time to do it. And Lauren played Linfield in the County Antrim Shield on Tuesday night. As a player, whenever you've got a game and then you know you've another big game um, after it, is that something that plays in your mind? Um, maybe sometimes, but I think obviously Lauren and, and ourselves, our priority will always be the league and they're doing well in the league, so I'm sure they'll be prioritising that. And, um, it's obviously a big game for them, but um, they've probably been disappointed with a couple of their results recently and it, um, it sets up for a really good tie for us. And, um, yeah, hopefully they are all thinking about it, but I wouldn't think so. I would say they'll be fully focused on on the game against us, and if we can uh, if we can start the game in the right way, then hopefully it'll be a good game. And there's been a lot of movement in the transfer window this week. The biggest of the window probably being Niall McGinn signing here at the Oval. What's it like, you know, performances on the pitch aside? What's it like having somebody like that with their experience in the dressing room? Oh, it's brilliant. Like I've been, been in a couple of Northern Ireland squads now, and he's a great lad. And, and to have someone like him come into our team and, and give us a wee bit of creativity and a great person too so I'm really delighted he's come in and hopefully he'll help you know, add to the options that we've got in the forward areas and, and give us you know, an option to hopefully kick on and score goals and create for us and I think that's something that we've, uh, we can add to our game.